Hello everybody on YouTube, Veritas Tech back with another video. I do have uh, the HTC 626 on white with the Marshmallow, so both for Metro PCS. But I have one on 6.0.1 Marshmallow update, uh, which is came uh, yesterday. So we already have downloaded the update and the phone has been updated already. And I still have the 5.1, the 626 Desire HTC. And in this video, I would like to explain what is the main differences between the Marshmallow on the HTC Desire 626 and the Lollipop Android for the same phone. So let's gonna find out. Now before I start talking about the differences on the operating system on the Marshmallow and the Lollipop I would like to do a booting test in order to see if there is any improvement to boot the system so I'm gonna get them turned on at the same time and see which one is going to be faster uh, first thing I have noticed that the display right now is dim and this is more bright on the one that has the Marshmallow which is the white phone And so far it's not acting at the same way. So this one still shows HTC and this one just bring the HTC logo. Yep, it seems to me the one that has lollipop booted the phone faster. Both phone, by the way, is factory seated. I don't have any application. All the application on the phone, they're just gonna be the stock application. So Marshmallow is gonna make your phone slower if you boot the phone. Now we don't wanna go in depth to test out the operating system here and there. Uh, we may gonna do that in a different uh, video, but well, I'm here for uh, to show you the differences So this is the main screen as you guys can see there is no any difference here even the icon everything looks just Identical that's gonna go to the main menu very much the same This is the background in red because uh, that phone is red and the other one is white uh, one things I have noticed zoo video editor it just be changed the name and the calendar it just uh, shows a different uh, icon over here so the difference in the calendar but overall there is no big difference just the icon looks a little bit different as you guys can notice I don't have any of improve improvement for the software now Facebook pre-installed on the phone I believe you have the car mode as well and another thing now if you are in the text message or somebody texts you or something you can just tap the go to Google and tap and Google should scan whatever information you have and take you to it and this one still doesn't do it you have to slide then go to Google now which is this is uh, one of the main difference and even I looked up to the emojis on phones I didn't notice any any of the difference in the emojis so they are very much identical just want to take you to it guys so very much you have the same emojis here and there not a huge difference now I'm gonna show you another difference when you just power the device up and you will see that this box just become different and more simple you have turn off airplane restart but you still have airplane kid modes and restart with a bigger window over here that's the only difference uh, the differences other than that it will be a uh, performance the uh, differences like it should uh, work better will be more optimized battery optimization Google and tap and some other security so now the application before you install you have to give permission with the marshmallow while the lollipop you don't have the permission so the marshmallow will be more secure I'm just highlighting right now uh, the differences mainly if after the upgrade or the update the operating system so if you be interested go ahead and up update i made a video to show you how to do the updates and that was very much it for now 
uh, thank you so much for watching and subscribe and thumbs up if you like and I'll see you in my next one